Hey there. Today I'm going to show you how to make a low carb lasagna using a noodles called Hearts of Palm Noodles. You can buy these in some stores. Uh, I bought them off of Amazon. They're called Palmony. They're plant based noodles. And you take them out of a can, rinse them. I've already pre rinsed them. And just place them into your pan. I've noticed that one can of Hearts of Palm noodles makes one 8 inch pan. And what I like to do with my lasagna is take... So I lined up the ingredients in order of how it usually goes. Noodles, meat, ricotta, marinara, the lowest carb one I could find, parmesan mozzarella. But what I like to do is take the ricotta it in with the beef so that it's easier to put on said noodles. You can layer them if you want. It's up to you how you do you. As you noticed, I don't like to use spoons for stirring because God gave me hands. Okay. And this is about... I already pre-browned the meat, as you could have told, told. As you saw. Um, and it was about a pound and a half of ground beef. You can use pork, you can use your preferred meats. I use ground beef. Pour that marinara on there. Put our cheese layer. It's, there's no Measurement for cheese, as I've said in a previous video. We don't measure cheese because everybody loves cheese. You just put it on there and you enjoy it. That's the beautiful thing about cheese. Okay. Sometimes you'll have a couple left over. If that's the case, just slip it under there. Now our base has a little extra. Then we'll stick the rest of our meat ricotta top, spread it out, make it a nice layer, want to make sure everybody gets a bite of goodness. Add more marinara. You can use however much marinara you want. We used almost a cup and a half. Put that cheese on there. Make sure it's a good layer. We love cheese.
and what I like to do is add a little Elvis parsley to the top to make it look pretty nice for decoration and show. My little oregano. I also use oregano, garlic powder, uh, onion powder, and minced garlic in my ground beef when I cook it. It gives the meat a little extra flavor. But you take your lasagna, you put it in your oven at 400 degrees for a nice 20 minutes and then you'll have a nice lasagna. So we'll do a jump cut and get back in about 20 minutes. So been about 20 minutes. Lasagna should be nice and toasty. Got everything cleared off and ready for this nice looking lasagna. Look at that. We have a low carb lasagna made with hearts of palm noodles. So I hope y'all out there learn something and uh, give it a try and enjoy it. Also all that cheese. Mm. Anyways, y'all have a good day. Take care. Eat healthy and enjoy.